the city's property protection classification rating was upgraded from a 4 to a 2. This rating is based on the city's ability to respond to fire emergencies. The better rating resulted in lower property insurance rates for many NRH residents and businesses. Less than 4% of the cities in the United States have a rating of 2 or better. The Public Works Department was recognized by the Federal Emergency Management Agency for exceeding the requirements of the National Flood Insurance Program. Thanks to these efforts, residents are eligible to receive a discount of 10 to 20 percent on flood insurance. Police Officer Tom Cleveland brought home several trophies from the World Police and Fire Olympics, including first place in the decathlon. Public Safety Dispatcher Laura Litzerman was selected as one of the state's silent heroes. This award is presented annually by the Texas Commission on State Emergency Communications to recognize exemplary performance in the field of emergency communications. Construction began on a new lake at Liberty Park. Once completed, the lake will be surrounded by trees and landscaping and will be an attractive habitat for wildlife. Iron Horse Golf Course celebrated its 20th anniversary. Several upgrades were made to the course in 2009 and the restaurant was renamed as C.A.'s Grill in honor of former city manager C.A. Sanford. Police officer Rodney McCrory was presented the Star of Texas Award by Governor Rick Perry. This award recognizes the bravery and sacrifices that Texas first responders make while performing their duties as police officers, firefighters, and emergency medical personnel. The city celebrated the redevelopment at the shops at Crown Point. The shopping center located at the corner of Lupe 20 and Ruth Snow Drive was updated with a new modern look. North Richland Hills welcomed Mark Heinemann as its new city manager. Mr. Heinemann replaced Larry Cunningham, who retired after more than 40 years in government service. Construction began on a new park across from NRH Public Library. The park will include a plaza with seating, sidewalks, landscaping, shade trees, and a unique public art piece that is titled Weather. The park is named Stormy Plaza, which recognizes the historical significance of the old Mangum Airport and its owner, Stormy Mangum. The city was presented the Clean Air Silver Award from the North Texas Clean Air Coalition. This award recognizes the city's programs and initiatives to curb air pollution. The North Richland Hills Public Library received an Achievement of Excellence in Library Services Award from the Texas Municipal Library Directors Association. The library soared to new heights in 2009 with more than 305,000 visitors and circulation totals exceeding three quarters of a million for the year. The city updated its ordinance related to door-to-door -door solicitors. The new ordinance includes several measures to protect residents from aggressive sales tactics. Reinvestment zone number one was expanded to include 392 acres along Boulevard 26. The expansion will help fund public improvements and it's part of the city's ongoing efforts to revitalize the Boulevard 26 corridor. New traffic signal lights were installed at the intersections of Davis Boulevard and Bercy Road, Precinct Line and Amundsen Road, and Precinct Line and Rumfield Road. The lights improved safety and access for several neighborhoods. The city approved an economic development agreement with Prestige Ameritech, the nation's largest manufacturer of surgical face masks. Under this agreement, Prestige Ameritech is moving its operations to North Richland Hills and bringing at least 400 jobs to the community. The North Richland Hills Police Department joined with Haltom City, Richland Hills, and Watauga to launch a new Crime Victims Liaison Program. This program provides victims of violent crime with assistance to speed their recovery and aid in prosecution. The Human Resources Department received the Champions in Health Workforce Wellness Award from the Health Industry Council of Tarrant County. The department was recognized for the success of the annual Health Check Biometric Screening Program and the Naturally Slim Program. The Police Department Traffic Section won 10 trophies at the Gulf Coast Police Motorcycle Skills Championship. There were almost 100 participants from across the country in this competition. The city hosted its 10th annual Night of Holiday Magic at NRH Shuo Family Water Park. Families enjoyed holiday entertainment, photos with Santa, and a snow tubing hill. This special event has become a holiday tradition that residents look forward to every year. The Neighborhood Services Consumer Health Division received the 2009 Texas Environmental Award of Excellence. This honor recognizes the consumer health staff for their high degree of professionalism and commitment to the community that they serve. NRH employees raised more than $42,000 for the United Way of Northeast Tarrant County. 
The contributions reflect the compassion that city employees have for our community. 2009 was certainly a busy and eventful year in the city of North Richland Hills. We hope you enjoyed this look back and will continue to tune in to City Cable NRH as we bring you more great news about the city of North Richland Hills during 2010. Thanks for watching.